Fum fum, yeah. So this is a corn, corn food. No way, but reddish color. So you see how that kind of looks like. No, no, West in the fum fum minute there, boy. Okay. No, you have to give me. Abba, abba, abba. No West in. If you are there, as in if you are there, not so. No what town? If you are friend there. No what town? No what town? No what town? Demon. Demon. Fuck Demon. Demon, you rapper? No, I don't rapper. You rapper, okay. Demon. Wow. Man, some dope, dope name. Wow. I like it. I like it. All move, all move. 24 7. I like it. Each and every day, they be a young boy. Boom, 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 boom. It's a bad thing. It's a bad thing. Demon. Wow. Hello brothers, brothers, sisters, sisters, how y'all do it? It's your boy, Cookie we see in the back again. Yeah, so I'm in Axim, in the western region of Ghana, in Zima land, yeah? And over here, they have this traditional food, very popular and famous. It's called Fum Fum. It's basically made from corn, and that uh, they have two versions of this food. They have the white version and the red version. So one of the differences is that the white one, the skin of the corn is being peeled off, whilst the red one is not. And also, the white one is pounded once before wrapping, whilst the red one is pounded twice before wrapping or selling and also the white one is being eaten by the people around Sekenita Krade whilst the red one is being eaten by the people in the typical Zima land it's similar to Benkun but because it has its own unique way of operation it makes it different from Benkun and the taste is so delicious it's mostly served with fish with hot pepper you can also serve with stew and soup as well you can't be in Azim on Zima land without trying Fum Fum the red color <laughs> local food and pan. It's a bit tedious to prepare this food by the end, you have an amazing meal. So let's go through the process of how Fum Fum is done. And uh, if today is the first time watching, can you share, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a brother. Let's do this, how <laughs> Koro? Yeah, so this is red corn or red maize, yeah? <laughs> and over here in Zuma, they use this to do Fum Fum. So this will be soaked inside water for three days, then we grind it. So after grinding, we have something like this. So this is what we'll be using for the Fum Fum. Okay, so this is our condo, yeah, the red one, and uh, it goes inside the hot water like this. We have our hot water on fire. Then yeah, now this goes inside the boiling water on fire. Wow. So, this be kept inside and that's been just boiled, as you can see. Okay, so now you pound this like this. So as you can see, the inside is being broken to pieces and you can see still dry. Okay, so it's like half done or half cooked. Yeah. Hey, what's your name? Mami Fua. Okay, so I'm here with Mami Fua, the Fum Fum seller. She pounds, she does everything. Yeah. <laughs> always experienced, but young girl, but always experienced, Mami Fua. So a little bit of water being added. Okay, to soften it. And how spun then you have to be rolling the, the pasta, okay, so that it doesn't pour out. This is one of the most difficult uh, public food in Ghana. So this food over here had some process and steps. Man, it's not easy. So you can see that the consistency and the texture is changing. Yeah. Very smooth and mixed together. Okay, so I have here, what's your name? Auntie Bella. Auntie Bella. Auntie Bella. Bella, okay. So this is Auntie Bella, okay. Uh, she's the founder or the owner of the Fum Fum. But how long have you been Fum Fum? Watch it. 20 years. 20 years, oh, okay. So she has been doing this food for 20 years. Me here, I could go to the They don't say, a process is very hard for me. You see, you know, you know, you know. Why do you want? Why do you want? 20 years that she has been doing this food. I'm about 20 years. Wow. Nancy, I'm going to use your book. 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 Oh, okay. But that's what I'm going to use your book. 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 What happened? Uh -huh. I told you. No, she said, 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 
What they never is calcum with you. And that's a calcum on your hardy. The calcum was in the day on a different name. You was a Hey, and a different process. Wow. No, calcum no different age would reach you on. I wish you on. On a case. Amazing. So after pounding, then they mold it like this. Okay, so as the lady was saying, they will reboil this again. Okay, so first boiling, they pound, then they mold it like this with the hole inside, and now they will reboil this again, and they will repound it again. Man, these are different steps. Wow. So this is our boiling water, or the water that will be used to boil this one. This have to boil very well. If not, I mean, as soon as you add, then everything will turn to porridge. Okay, so now we have uh, uh, the dough inside the boiling water. Okay, so um, it's been like 30 minutes and uh, we have our boiling uh, condo over here. So we are going to, about to pound this again. Okay, so we now pound our foam foam like this. Okay, so this is the second time that we are pounding, and uh, as you can see, this is different. So the first pounding had that whitish color. Okay, this is all red and brown, meaning it's it's cooked now. Okay, so I'm about to try this to see. And, uh, and when it's ready, they also serve it fish in kampana and uh, hot pepper. Okay. So some of the water or the liquid is okay. being poured around and uh, this over here there's no salt inside they roll it like this for three cities and uh, I have mine here like that okay ah I'm chilling I'm chilling man two cities fish was zimo and you crank and crack a baby though so as you can see, as I said, this is two cities fish at Zim. Man, they are crab water by 15 cities. Yeah, amazing. Anyway, so basically we have our foam foam here, the red one with the camphana and uh, the hot pepper over there. Okay, yeah, so foam foam here. Yeah. As you see the procedure, this is a corn, corn food, anyway, but reddish color. So you see how the color looks like. And, uh, I fried the top the one. The top the one is white. This is red. So there's a difference between the two. This is more of the Enzima kind of version. Mm. Man, like condo. What's the condo now? The condo, the condo, the condo. In a... Wow. Amazing. Man. It's delicious. So basically it's like eating a toe, kind of, yeah? It's like eating a toe, no problem. Man! You can't be in a zoom. I want to see my land with that trying foam foam. The red color. I want to see my land with that trying foam foam. I want to see my land with that trying foam foam. I want to see my land with that trying foam foam. I want to see my land with that trying foam foam. I want to see Crazy, okay. Mm. Oh, no. Oh, no. Mm. Yeah, so if this is the first time watching, kindly subscribe, tell a friend, tell a brother. I will be a for Yeah, so this is live from Axim in Zuma. Let's do this again for Shizuma Nizzo about record one. Today's video is sponsored by GK Homes, and GK Homes is a modern real estate company that builds luxury European two and three bedroom townhouses at Amasama and Accra, Ghana. All rooms are fully furnished with modern quality luxury styles like top floor family or play area, luxury German kitchen style, walk-in closet, bedroom balconies, spacious living room, and all the doors are being fitted with techy security doors. There's also security walls with alarm systems, modern staircase, and so many more. It's also affordable, so if you want to become house owner with peace of mind to sleep and to work, 
GK Homes is what you need. They also have an amazing payment plan for your mortgage that you love it. So what are you waiting for? Call this number on the screen, plus 44789717 6552. GK Homes, signature of luxury and quality. Or <laughs>